Wales dialed up the emotion ahead of their Six Nations battle with England on Saturday with the help of Gareth Bale. The Welsh actor not the real Madrid footballer performed a one-man show at the Principality Stadium on Monday in England's dressing room for the weekend's match which stirred the passion among the home squad. The hour-long play Grav is based on the life of former Wales player turned broadcaster Ray Gravel who was part of the great sight of the 1970s and died in 2007. The play was powerful, it definitely showed the pride that Grav had, and we all have in Wales, said wing George North. I could hear muckers, forwards coach Robin McBride, chomping at the bit. HIM and Ken Owens were fighting over the hooker shirt at one point. They were both crying. Sometimes rugby is methodical, and you have to go through your plays and set pieces, your moves and attack, but there's no lack of pride, that's for sure. Pride is still something I and I know all the boys feel when they put on the jersey. When the anthem is sang, the cheering has finished and the whistle goes, everybody wants to be there. You look back on being a young boy playing in the park and those memories goes through your mind as you get ready to go. McBride added, we should have played straight after the .it really put us in a good place mentally. If we can in any way match Gareth J. Bale's performance on Saturday, it doesn't matter if the roof is open or closed, there will only be one result. Dan Bigger returned to full training and is in contention for selection. Lee Halfpenny also was involved, but is still highly unlikely to feature on the weekend, having not played for three months after concussion issues. On England, McBride said, It is going to be red hot. England riding high, coming to Cardiff. They are going to be confident. We have got to stand toe to toe and go at it with them. We have got to be on top of our game. There's no hiding place on Saturday.